We have Chris Clemens in the house, everybody. Dude, we're in a car, not a house. Oh yeah, we're in a car. So, How is life going? Man, life's going really good. Uh, we didn't get to go to the West Coast last year in 2020, so getting to come this year has been amazing. Santa Cruz was sick. I mean, Goat Hill was sick. OTB was sick. And Portland's been amazing so far. Okay, now the most important question there is. Are you subscribed to my YouTube channel? Of course. Why wouldn't I be? Be like Chris. Like and subscribe. Are you subscribed to my YouTube? I think so. Let what? Me, let me check. How do you not know? Let me check. What? Are, they, are, are they subscribed subscribing to my YouTube? You wanna, you wanna actually see? Like no, I wanna right know. Now. I want that you know. He's not. He's I'm, not. Look at I'm, that face. I'm more confident that I'm not subscribed to Simon Lazat. I don't know. Are you subscribed? Yes, Simon. Of course I'm subscribed. Oh, then I'm subscribed. Thanks. Are you subscribed to my YouTube channel? I'm subscribed in three different channels. What? That is the only right answer, guys. <laughs> okay. I don't think it's clogged because it's not open clogged. Oh, this one looks so good. Oh, <laughs> I got it perfect. Look at the beauty. It is an early morning ish in Mass. I'm joined by Marky, and we are back on the vlog at a new course for me. Marky, how long has this course been around? Uh, probably about 10 years or so. All right, this course has been here forever. <laughs> I haven't, but I am here at Tully Lake. Kind of center, north, is Ma north, north Massachusetts. Kind of right in the bang middle of the state. Um, about an hour drive for me, and this is the site I got treated with. Beautiful hole one. Let's see if I can knock down my first putt. And welcome back to the channel. Little update vlog, haven't been posting in a while, so excited to be back with local guy. I don't know how it went in, but it counts. First putt of the day. Oh my God. Okay, welcome back. Marky Chapelonski. Oh, no pressure. He's a veteran to the vlog, guys. If you've been following me for a while, you've seen his face. But if you haven't, one of the top five players in Mass, I'd say. I believe so. And uh, almost a thousand rated guy. Let's yep. see what he's got. Man, I gotta get used to this filming thing again. Feels like it's been forever. And I told Mark I'm just gonna follow his lines. That looked pretty good. Pin eye right. Like that's my job. <laughs> Let's check out hole three right here. Nice tee pad in the sun. And then we're in the woods, right on the lake. Can we ace it? Yeah, 198 feet. Oh, that's it. Oh my. Well, I'll take the birdie, but that's about it. Perfect layup. Yeah, no ace. On pace. On pace for the shoot course record. Go in. Ooh. Nutri shot. Oh no. Local route. Sneaky back door. Local route. <laughs> Basket is somewhere there, maybe. I just got back from my second tournament this year was the Portland Open in Portland, Oregon. And what an event. I actually ended up being on freaking feature card, Joe Miss card, all three rounds. And I hate to say it, but I had like kind of a legit w chance to win a pro tour on the biggest course we've ever played on tour. Apparently, that's what I've heard. And man, overall, pretty stoked with my tee shots. My elbow has been holding up good great almost I want to say and as as much as a test of course could be my elbow held up in Portland and now I'm home for like 10 days ish headed to Salt Lake City for the world championships and man if I could pull off a lead card at the world right now whew, 
That'd be stoked. But thanks everyone for tuning in. We're just enjoying a nice little summer around here in mass. Let's see if Mark can knock down this tricky little 30 footer. He needs to straddle and even forehand. This would be like a highlight reel and he makes it look like no problem. Go. That's what we brought him here for folks. What? I somehow parked it. Still on pace. Course record is 11 down. That's what Marky said. New course so record. So let's try and break that. <laughs> I'm also representing a Canadian shirt brand today. Diameter Apparel. <laughs> I probably butchered that, but check out all the attractions. Canada. Gotta love it. All right, hole five. Seems like a little ace run. Oh no. Get lucky. Wow, that was the worst shot I've ever seen. Why not like that first try, man? All right, after that sidearm magic make, can he do it the normal way? Wow. That was like super dead center. Super, super good. How's it feel? Great. I just beat Simon on that hole. Oh, come on, man. That is good disc golf. One of the best putters in mass and the best forehand in mass. Yeah, I'll take that. All right, let's quickly talk about my first event back three weeks ago, which was the OTB Open, because I never even talked about that either, because I'm a bad YouTuber. But uh, it was good, pretty solid. I finished 13th, almost got a top 10 on my first event back. Also a monster course, a lot of rollers out there. Angles I haven't really practiced much in in mass here and during rehab but overall definitely a success therapy wise and i've been pretty happy with my putting game which is nice um not perfect nowhere near perfect of course but something to build on yeah i think i averaged my rating in california 1035 and then i averaged like 1042 ish in portland oregon last week so i'm headed slightly in the right direction and I can't wait for Worlds next week. Stay tuned. People have been asking me what this disc was. I threw it all over Portland last week. And this is a Sea Line MD. Let's see if we can get it close. Oh my God. Hit. So bad. Oh, God. That actually went into Heiser back, which is insane. This basket says nine, but it's actually Slop 11. Signs are a lot, Telly. Don't go left, don't go right. All right, we have a par four. <laughs> yep. Not sure. This four. hole doesn't have a T pad because it's a fire hazard. Fire, fire access road. Fire access road. Yep, not a hazard. <laughs> not a hazard. So if there's a fire, they need to get water from the lake. This is where they go. All right, let's see it. He's going harp harp. Oh, he he must like that one. That's so good. That's good. What a cool hole. And Mark, he's just doing the perfect. Oh, that's a little long. That's a butt. Tester. I never gave it a chance for an eagle. Oh. <laughs> The great thing about terrible up shots is you get to make a sick putt. Always remember. Or double frustration. Tricked ya. Guys, I haven't done a slow mo montage in so long. So listen to the music and enjoy.
Here's my POV 20 footer. <laughs> Sick. There's Simon on hole 17. Who knows? Disappointing finishing hole. But we made it to the last hole. Why can't I make one? All right, last putt. Welcome to the vlog. All right, we did it. That was 18 holes at Tully. We actually ended up tying both shot 11 down, which is okay. Not bad for a little morning round. It's technically course record. Technically. Yeah, of course. So yeah, we're actually headed to shoot the vlog of the year, maybe potentially, but that's coming out a bit later than this. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe, and enjoy the shot of the day. And see the next one. Peace. Stay stable. Cut in, ace it. Oh. Oh.